So if you take your goals right now, can you think of two goals right now in your head? What's the time frame on both those goals? And if you said one's a year, one's two years, why not do one now and also do the other one now? And let's just quit f***ing around with these next two years. Because the next two years, I would like to actually be doing big sh instead of saying, oh, we're working our way up. Hey, dude, that's your old life. Only crazy people get remembered. Only crazy people do things that inspire other people. Because if it's not crazy, then we see everything else that's going on, it won't catch my attention. And so if you want people saying, how'd you do it? Well, I believed in myself and I put my back against the wall before the rest of the world thought I was ready. I knew I was ready. You're not gonna talk like you used to talk. You're not gonna have the same language. You're not gonna have the same focus. You're gonna be focusing on different stuff now. Your body's gonna start looking different, dude. Like, you just woke up, you're gonna get serious. But when you start doing this, like, people that you are with currently in your, in your life right now, I just want just fair warning, like, you've been put on notice, that 95% of them will not be okay with that. doesn't have the life that they want, that doesn't have it, I need you to think, do you know what it looks like? Do you know what, it, what you want? I'm going to tell you this. You will always commonly hear me talk to you guys about mindset. Always. Always, okay? Because look, if you go into a fight and you think you're going to lose, you're going to lose. Am I right? If you go into a fight and you think you're going to lose, you're going to get knocked out. Yes, you can never doubt yourself. Never. How many of you right now, guess what, are a little bit comfortable? Okay? Burn that. Burn that. Guys, I want to say this. Stay starving. Not stay hungry. Stay starving. Guys, how do you stay starving? Well, you got to have something in front of you that you're chasing. Listen, I have a vision of who I want to be in front of me at all times. And I take inventory of that daily. And I wonder, is, am I becoming that guy? Or did I stall out, right? Like, am I in neutral right now? Or am I in fifth gear? Or some of you are in reverse. So many of you right now, you're capable of so much. You know this. You're resilient, you're a grinder, you're hungry, you're starving, your story matters, your name matters. Up to this point, how bad is your story? How crazy is it? What did you do? Who did you screw over? Okay, who is you mean to? Who are the people that loved you and then you betrayed them? That's a part of your past. What will we do from today forward? Because that's all that matters. By the way, can I tell you this? What's y'all's favorite movie? The movie where it starts out where some rich kid gets a bunch of money from his dad, spends a whole bunch of money, the whole movie goes by, he buys whatever he wants, he never has a problem, and then the movie ends? Or is it a movie like Rocky? He was the underdog. Nobody thought he was gonna make it. He had everything going against him. And the underdog, the David, smashed the Goliath because they believed in themselves, because they did the work, because they told themselves who they were, and they didn't give up and they had hope. Guys, those are their favorite stories. The stories that start out with the dude living in his car, right? And he's a drug addict, but then pulls himself out and ends up changing a whole country.